An abandoned baby was found between some rails by a cat, and what the animal did next left everyone in awe. Cats can be seen as fairly cold creatures who only put up with people in order to get food and to have a warm place to sleep at night, but that isn't always true, as shown by the heroic cat in this story. Adam lived in a small, rural village in the Kaluga region of Russia. He had grown up there and loved his home and the beautiful forest that surrounded it. Throughout all of his childhood, Adam had loved to explore the woods, often finding new and amazing things hidden within them. One of these things was an old railway line that cut through a portion of the forest. The line itself was out of use and the tracks all overgrown, and so Adam regularly liked to visit the tracks to hike along them. One day, Adam decided that he wanted to revisit the abandoned train tracks as it was a lovely sunny day perfect for a long walk in the woods. He packed a small lunch and headed out into the forest, ready to get lost in nature. Little did he know that this day would change his life forever. As Adam made his way along the train tracks, he allowed his mind to drift and take in the peaceful scenery around him. But then, something unusual happened. The man suddenly saw a shadow dart between the trees. Worried that it could be a wolf or another kind of predator, Adam stopped still and began to pay closer attention to the surrounding trees. The shadow appeared again, but it was very small, definitely too small to be a dangerous wild animal. Thinking that it was possibly a squirrel, as the man had noticed the creature had a big, fluffy tail, Adam decided to carry on walking. He only made his way a little bit further down the tracks though, when he noticed something very strange. It seemed like the shadow was following him, but keeping its distance. Curious as to what the strange creature might be, Adam decided to stop and see if he could approach it. At first, the man simply tried calling out to the animal in a soft voice to see if it would respond to him. The creature stopped but stayed within the tree line. Creeping forward a few steps, Adam was able to make out what kind of animal had been following him. It was a cat, and from the look of its shaggy and roughed up fur, it seemed as if it was abandoned. Being an animal lover, Adam didn't want to leave the stray feline out in the woods by itself. He knew that there were predators in the woods who would be able to easily catch and eat the little cat. The man began to creep closer to the wary feline, calling out to it to encourage the animal to approach him. But when he was within a few feet of the cat, he noticed something that shocked him. Adam could tell that the cat was female as her milk ducts were swollen, which also meant that she had a litter of kittens nearby. Amazed by the discovery, Adam tried to get closer, but at the last minute, the feline suddenly ran away further up the tracks. But instead of leaving Adam for good, the cat stopped and turned around as if waiting for the man to follow it. Interested in what the cat wanted, Adam started walking down the train tracks again, in the same direction that the feline was going. The duo walked for a few minutes before Adam suddenly started to hear something strange. It sounded like a baby's cry, and he was getting closer to it. Finally, the cat seemed to stop and jump down in between the rails before curling up into a ball. Adam slowly walked closer to the animal, only to see that it had cuddled up with her litter of three kittens and, astonishingly, a baby. The man was very confused and concerned. Why was this baby in the woods? Who had left it there? How long had it been on its own with no one but the cat and her babies to look after it? While these thoughts rushed through his mind, Adam quickly rushed over to where the cat was lying to get a better look at the young child, but as he tried to pick the baby up, the cat started to hiss. It seemed as if the feline had begun to care for the baby as if it were one of her own kittens. Not knowing what to do, Adam sat back and simply observed the unusual family. The man knew that he had to get to the baby somehow, as it would not survive on its own for much longer. But the mama cat didn't want to let him close. It was at this point that the man remembered the food in his backpack. The mama cat looked quite thin, and since she had to care for three little ones, she was bound to be hungry. Maybe he could gain her trust by offering her some food. Adam carefully took the bag off of his back so as not to frighten the weary mama cat and took out the chicken sandwich that he had made for himself. Instantly, the mama feline perked up at the sight and smell of the food. Adam took a piece of chicken off of the bread and slowly made his way forward until he was only a few feet away from the animal. The man softly called out, encouraging the cat to take the meat. Hesitantly, the mama stood up and sniffed at the piece of food being offered to her. She then cautiously took the meat from the man's hand and ate it in one bite. With the food all gone, the shabby kitty meowed at Adam and bumped his hand as if to ask for some more. Adam laughed and fed her some more chicken. 
After a few more bites, the cat seemed to have warmed up to the man and began purring at him whilst asking for some love. Adam happily obliged and began to stroke the cat. With the mama feline seemingly trusting him now, Adam decided to try and reach for the baby again. This time the cat simply watched as Adam picked the young child up. As soon as the man had the baby in his arms, the child stopped crying and looked up at him. Now that he was closer, Adam could see that the baby was a little girl and that she couldn't be more than a few weeks old. Shocked by the fact that someone could just leave a helpless baby all by itself, Adam checked the child over to make sure that she was okay. Thankfully, apart from a few little scratches and bruises, the baby appeared to be in good health. The man stood back up and began to make his way back along the rails when he heard a meow. Turning to look, Adam saw that the mama cat was watching him. The man then looked at the animal and her babies and knew that he couldn't leave them to fend for themselves either. He made his way back towards the felines and bent down to stroke the mama cat again. He softly reassured her that he was going to help her and her babies before scooping one of the kittens up and placing it in his backpack. He did this with the rest of the small animals as their mama watched. Once all of the kittens were safely tucked into the bag, Adam softly called to the adult feline and began to make his way back to his village. The mama cat followed the man carrying her babies. Once everyone was safely back in the village, Adam quickly set the kittens and the mama cat into his home before taking the baby to the nearest hospital. Once there, the man explained to the doctor what had happened and how he had found the baby thanks to the cat. The doctor was amazed by the story. He checked the baby over before telling Adam that she appeared mostly healthy apart from being a bit dehydrated and hungry. Adam was relieved and asked the doctor what was going to happen to the child. The doctor explained that she would be put in foster care whilst police looked into trying to find her mother, but if no one was found, she would be put up for adoption. Adam thanked the doctor and asked him to contact him if the child was put up for adoption. The man then went home to find that the cat and her babies had already made themselves comfortable in his living room. Adam then took the animals to the local vets so they too could get a checkup to make sure that they were all healthy. Once given the all clear, Adam took the mama cat, whom he decided to name Mystique, and her babies back home. A few months later, Adam received a phone call telling him that no relatives of the baby girl he had found had come forward and that she was being put up for adoption. Adam immediately put his name up to adopt the girl, who had been named Willow, and after signing all of the legal paperwork, he became the proud father of an amazing little girl, and the child was finally reunited with her unusual surrogate mother. How amazing was the story? Let me know in the comments below, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more awesome stories.